postpartum symptoms, I still have a few of them. It's now three weeks since I gained birth. I still have the kind of teariness, I would say more than the moodiness. Um, I tend to find myself crying. I wouldn't say every day, but like every two days, I'll just like over something and I'll get really emotional and I just sort of cry for a few minutes and then it goes away. I mean, and then I feel a little bit sort of like cleaned out. I mean, it's not so great because I've always like cried off whatever makeup I've put on, but I feel sort of cleaned out and refreshed almost as if my body needs to cry. The same way I was like sweating so much at night during the initial one or two weeks after I had the baby. This sort of teariness or mood swings are coming from the hormones in your body, fatigue, and the sheer stress of taking care of a new baby. The way to deal with these is to get as much rest as possible, to eat as healthy as possible, and to just stay hydrated with water, herbal teas, and healthy liquids. Make sure you're getting enough nutrients, including an iron supplement and vitamin D. And week three might be a really good time to start to get outside with your baby, meet up with some friends, take a walk, just catch a break. If your mood swings or your teariness have gone further than this and you find yourself having really destructive, you know, violent thoughts or you feel as if you're in despair, that is a serious thing. That could be a sign of postpartum depression and you should reach out to a healthcare professional immediately. For a much more thorough discussion on other postpartum symptoms, including constipation, which I really had this time, postpartum bleeding, a sore perineum, and pregnancy hormones, check out my videos for week one and week two.